क्लास टेन एक्सरसाइज नंबर 5.2 क्वेश्चन नंबर 12 लेट ए बी सी एंड डी गिवन पॉइंट्स है शो दैट ए बी सी डी इज ए ट्रपेजियम वी नो दैट ट्रपेजियम मींस वन ऑफ द साइड वन ऑफ द ऑपोजिट साइड्स आर पैरेलल एंड देन अनदर ऑपोजिट साइड्स आर नॉट पैरेलल दैट इज कॉल्ड ए ट्रपेजियम लेट मी टेक इट एज द क्वाड्रिलैटरल ए बी सी डी First, we take it the coordinate A B C D, and then we don't know which two sides are parallel, right? So let me take it as A B C D as a coordinate. Then either A D is parallel to B C, then these two sides are not parallel, or otherwise A B is parallel to D C means, and then other two sides are not parallel. Let's see the solution. Now we want to find the slope for each and every side. There is a side A B, B C, and C D, and it is A. Right? So first, I am going to find that slope of A and B. The A point and the B point. The slope A B is equal to when two points are given. We know the formula y two minus y one divided by x two minus x one. The A point is three comma minus four and then B point is nine comma minus four. The first point is x one y one. The second point is x two y two. Now apply the values. Y two is equal to minus four minus of minus four divided by nine. Minus three. This term is equal to minus four minus into minus plus four divided by six. Minus four and plus four is equal to zero. Zero divided by any number is equal to zero. Therefore, the slope of AB is equal to zero. Next, we want to find out the slope of BC. Slope BC. We have the same formula. Y two minus y one divided by x two minus x one. So the B point is nine comma minus four. And then C point is five comma minus seven. Right? Here also the same point. First one is x one y one. Second is x two y two. So y two is equal to minus seven minus of y one is minus four divided by x two is five minus nine. When you substitute this, we get minus seven minus into minus plus four divided by. 5 minus 9 is equal to minus 4. This term is equal to minus 3 divided by minus 4. Hence, 3 by 4. Both numerator and denominator having the negative value, so we cancel. We get 3 by 4 is the another slope. Now we want to find the side CD, side CD and AD, right? C point is 5 comma minus 7, and then D point is 7 comma minus 7. Slope CD is equal to y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. x1 y1, x2 y2. y2 is equal to minus 7 minus of x1 is equal to y1 is equal to minus 7 divided by x2 is 7 minus y x1 is 5. This term is equal to minus 7 minus into minus plus 7 divided by 2. Minus seven plus seven is cancelled. Zero zero divided by any number is equal to zero. So the slope of CD is equal to zero. Then we want to find out what is the slope of AD. A point is three comma minus four, and D is given as seven comma minus seven. The slope AD is equal to y two minus y one divided by x two minus x one. Right? Then this is the point x1 y1 x2 y2 y2 is minus seven minus of minus four divided by seven minus three is equal to minus seven minus into minus plus four divided by seven minus three is four. Now subtract this we get minus three divided by four. This is the slope right? Now see the slope. Slope of AB is also zero. The slope of AB is zero, and then same time the slope of CD is equal to zero. Then the slope of AB is parallel to slope of DC. Then another side, the BC is not equal to AD. BC we get three by four, and AD is minus three by four. Therefore, slope AB is equal to Slope CD, therefore AB is parallel to 
CD by the condition of M1 is equal to M2. The two slopes are equal means then it is parallel. And then AB is parallel to CD and then BC is not parallel to AD. Therefore, in a trapezium, one of the side is parallel and then another side is not parallel means then we can conclude that ABCD is a trapezium. Right? Ends the proof. Thank you students.